Where are we at? We're here at the CrossFit Lilburn uh, Ninja Core training facility. Okay, so what's your routine like? Some laps around the track, and then we do some jumping spider, some quintuple steps, and move into the laches, the upper body, cliffhanger, the salmon ladder. Keep training. Got to submit my video pretty soon, and then got a couple months to get ready for qualifiers. Just trying to train a couple of days a week, minimum. Right. Have you seen any uh, progress? Oh yeah, of course, progress all the time. My general strategy is don't push yourself too hard because injury sets you back. Right. So I just stay at my comfort level and I try to increase my comfort level. I remember when I started climbing, the same thing, which mm -hmm. is, you know, I just train, 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 get so beat. And then eventually, you know, you can do the same stuff that you've been doing and it doesn't damage you so much. So you gotta keep pushing a little bit. I was always watching it back in the day, back when they had a Suzuki in right, right. Japan, right? They make it look so easy, but it's gotta be way harder than that. And then I kept seeing all these climbing guys doing well, and I've been climbing now for almost four years. And I said, you know, well shoot, if these guys are doing it, maybe I could try the um, Ninja Core Groupon. So then Ninja I came Groupon, here yeah. and did the did the little one hour training session with Justin and uh, one of the trainers here. And then, you know, I was just hooked immediately. Same just with climbing. Love. The first time I went climbing, I was like, that's it, no more soccer. Besides the training, what have you been doing? Well, teaching at Georgia Tech. How many years have you been teaching? At Tech, four years, been teaching total like 12 or 13 years at the university. Being a professor is great. The Georgia Tech students are so smart. They work so hard. I've been married for 14 years and my daughter's just turned 13. Uh, my son, he's nine. Yeah, my wife, we, we've been married and happy for a long time. It's really a blessing just to have all the things that I have with the family. It's wrong to think that I'm just gonna go and destroy it, but that's, that's what I think. I think I'm just gonna go and just like obliterate it. And I don't know how to make sense out of it because I'm a very logical person, right? I'm right. like a mathematician. You're a, ma you're a I, I'm like, like a scientist, you know, at heart. Like I, I like evidence and I have no evidence to support this belief. Right, right, right. But, you know, I just, that I can just picture it in my head, just like, just crushing it. Now, there's some part of me always in anything in life, you know, you have that little part of you that says, you're, tr you're lying to yourself, that's not real. You're just, it's just a fantasy. But I mean, I think fantasy dream, this is what gets you motivated to, to do things. This is how people take risks. This is how people change, how they get stronger, how they mm. change their lives is because they have to have the dream first. My name's Sal Barone. I'm 36 years old, professor at Georgia Tech in the School of Mathematics, and I am an American Ninja Warrior.